Well, I'm here with Rodney Kagayama. Oh, I can't say those names. How yeah. do you say it? Kagayama. 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 Is there a special meaning behind that last name? Or? Means Shade Mountain. Shade Mountain. That's very artsy. Yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> kind of sexy, huh? Oh, yeah. I'm Rodney Shade Mountain. Rod the Shade Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> is that your pickup line? <laughs> So, tell us a little bit about your involvement with East West Players. Well, I, I'm from San Francisco originally, and I came up, came down to uh, LA in 1979, and I worked with East West Players t since then. Wow. Yeah, with Mako and like everybody I was talking about, you know. And then Mike came in in 1980s, early 1980s, and it was interesting because he was a little fledgling, you know. But he really uh, grew up and just gotten his wings, you know, and did really, really well. And he's still doing really, really well, you know. So when you moved to L.A., did you know you wanted to do theater all the way? Yes, because I was over in San Francisco. I was with the uh, Asian American Theater Company. I'm one of the founders. And then I was also with ACT, American Conservatory Theater. And so I thought, I better come down here and play with the big guys. And I was very lucky during that particular time because I came down here, and within two weeks I got an apartment, an agent, a psychic, a car. A, a, sci oh, a, sci a psychic? Oh, yeah, a psychic. I need to hear more about this. Uh, no, well, you know, back then, you know, everybody had to have a psychic. You know, to, to, <laughs> to, actor. An actor to, to see how their career was going. But then, you know, and then in, within the two weeks, I was one of Johnny Carson's Mighty Carson players for a season. And uh, ever since then, I was working, you know, constantly, and I didn't have to get a straight job or anything till about five years ago. But then five years, I said, I won't do it anymore. It's, it's fun mentoring the other kids. <laughs> it's fun mentoring. So would you still recommend a psychic for aspiring actors? Psychic would, no, not anymore. <laughs> not anymore. No, there's no real psychics anymore. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Yeah, we appreciate a lot with what you've done with the Asian community and helping to make, you know, getting Asians more involved in the media. Well, thank you. Uh, that's, that's what I'm here for. Thank you. Thank you.